I'm Nick Collins. I'm in the medicine and healthcare program, and I'm going to 12th grade. I've had some experience suturing before. My mom taught me how to do the interrupted stitch and the continuous stitch, but I'd never seen the subcutaneous stitch, so it was really interesting to learn how to suture a limb without letting it be shown. And it was nice to do it with other people and to share, because we could kind of critique each other and help each other out. My name's Abby Rhoda, and I'm in the medicine and healthcare program, and I will be a junior next year. It was something that I've never done before, so it was cool to like learn how to do that and figure out like how it's done. And I didn't know that there were so many different types of suturing, so I thought that was really interesting. And then I felt like she was a good teacher and I learned a lot and was able to understand very well as to what she was saying. I'm Ankit Shajed. I'm in the HEAL Health and Medicine Healthcare program and I'll be a senior in the fall of 2019. I'm a lot less dexterous than I thought I was originally. It's so hard to like grab the individual needles and the thread and the forceps and stuff, but after a while you get the hang of it and it gets kind of fun. Um, it was cool to learn the different types and how it kind of like evolved from single thing suturing to kind of running over and then becoming just under the skin. But like with a lot of practice, I think I get the hang of it. I'm Olivia Rohde. I'm in the medicine and health care program and I'm going into 10th grade. It was really cool. I've never done suturing before. I mean, I've done sewing, but it's nothing like that. And it was harder than I expected, honestly, because I'd be able to like use both my hands equally, but my left hand, like I can't do anything. And it was really cool, like especially the people, because they were all so fascinated by everything that she was doing up in front and showing us how to do the stuff. And back at home, like none of my friends, they n wouldn't have reacted like that. It was just really cool to be around all those people that have like the same interests as me.